Mvutano ni mkubwa katika mpango wa makazi ya Chapchiona huko Transiziona kwani zaidi ya wakazi elfu moja waliofukuzwa wanashutumu kwamba kuna kundi la wafanyabiashara ambao wanashirikiana na maofisa kutoka Wizara ya Ardhi ambao wao wanaona ni kana kwamba kuna kitu ambacho hakiko sawa hapo. A, watu hao ambao walifukuzwa katika eneo hilo wametishia kwamba watatafuta suluhisho la mahakama ikiwa wizara haitawarudishia ardhi yao. Sasa wale wazazi walikuwa wanatulisha ni wale ambao walipata haki yao pale. Sasa wanaanza kuondolewa sasa hizi. Watoto wao wanahangaika. Na haiwezi haiwezi wakahangaika kama sisi wengine bado tuko hai namna hii. Haiwezekani. Mpaka sasa hii naongea. Zaidi ya watu 1632 waliopewa ardhi hiyo na ADC ambao wengi wao walikuwa wafanyikazi wa shamba hilo wako nje tumepoteza watu kwa sababu ya njaa tumepoteza watu kwa sababu watoto wao hawezi kusoma serikali iko tu na hatujaelezwa sababu watu hao walibomolewa pia hatujaelezwa kwa nini wale watu hawawezi kupewa ardhi what was the objective of settlement schemes in Kenya it was to allocate land and settle the squatters and these are the squatters who are being who are being pushed out of the land who are being given land every tom dick and harry from everywhere far and wide on financial considerations when the real people who should be given land are left to suffer in poverty and i would wish to ask her to visit all land uh, fraud hotspot areas i'm giving her notice that transoya is one of the land fraud hotspots wale wanalima saizi ni matajiri wakubwa kubwa sana ambaye ujui nani Jesu ndio anachunga hata nataka watu wa wale wanaohusika nimeuliza NCIC wakuje na waone nini naendelea hapa hivi hii si community moja maana unajua kwa mawazo ya wengi wanafikiri ni pokotu peke yake huyu jamaa mwenye wako hapa hivi ni mtu kutoka Nyanza lakini ni wale walisaliwa hiyo wazazi wao walifanya kazi hapo na wakapata haki yao kutoka hapo na hawa ndio tunatetea. Nafikiri wizara ya ya LAN iko na shida kubwa sana. Kwa hata waziri mwenyewe hatusikii akizungumza. Na ni mtu alikuwa very alikuwa shupavu sana. Kwa sababu hata yeye wakati mmoja wakati alikuwa kwa mambo ya ya nini ya mambo ya press na nini na nini. Alifanya kazi mzuri. Wakati aliweka hapo tukafikiri sasa ndio atakosoa na ataangalia shida ile iko. Lakini sasa amekuwa ile mwisho. More so we are we are giving you notice that if you are not going to reshuffle the land office in Kitale we are going to flush them out because these are our servants and Kenya is not in shortage of workers so that we, we entertain cartels in the offices Tarifa hii imeandaliwa na Innocent Matara kutoka Kenya kwenye mitandao ya kijamii Facebook na Instagram ni Global Publishers Twitter ni Global Habari Wizara ya Viwanda na Biashara kupitia mamlaka ya maendeleo ya biashara Tanzania Tantred inawa taarifu umma wa Tanzania kuwa inaandaa maonyesho ya sita ya bidhaa za viwanda vya Tanzania yatakayofanyika kuanzia tarehe tatu hadi tisa Disemba 2021 Maonyesho haya yatakayoenda sambamba na sherehe za miaka sitini ya uhuru wa Tanganyika yana kauli mbiu isemayo tumia bidhaa za Tanzania jenga Tanzania ikihamasisha Tanzania kutumia bidhaa bora zinazozalishwa na viwanda hapa nchini maonyesho haya yatafanyika kwenye uwanja wa maonyesho wa Mwalimu Nyerere saba, saba kwa ushiriki au maelezo zaidi tafadhali wasiliana nasi kupitia barua pepe sac@tantred.go.tz instagram @tantredtz facebook tantred tanzania na twitter tantred page au piga simu namba Sifuri saba tano nane, sifuri sifuri, moja sifuri, mbili moja.